What's up, family? This is Aqua Goddess coming to give you all a general reading. Please keep in mind that this reading will be for past, present, future, and it may or may not resonate with you. If you are interested in booking a personal reading with me, if you would like to donate to the channel, purchase any artwork or manifestation jewelry, the information will be in our description box below. If you are new to my channel, welcome my love and thank you so much for being here. Please don't be shy. Join the family. I would love to have you. Make sure you subscribe to the channel for your future readings. If you are not new, you're returning back. You've been rocking it out with me. Thank you. I love you and I truly appreciate it. So we're just going to go ahead and do a general energy reading for earth signs. This will be for Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. I will get back to your zodiac signs probably first thing tomorrow. I'm going to be working on our second channel today, Troy's Mermaid Palace. So make sure you guys go check it out. Watch the collective reads. Subscribe. Show your girl some love. But we're going to go ahead and tap right in. All right. Holy Spirit, angels, ancestors, guides most high. Please protect me and my collective as I channel the messages for the signs of Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Please return all negative energy back to sender, 20 million fold. And anyone out there showing me love, much love and light to you. Alright, Spirit, what do we have for my earth signs? I've been having freaky dreams about you. I miss it. And then you have orgy. Okay. <laughs> so, um, somebody thinks that you're so sexy. They miss you. Uh, they miss the way that you touch them. They uh, think about you all the time. This person thinks about you so much, they having dreams about you. They feel like you're the best person to have an orgy with. I'm going to be real with you. <laughs> so, you bring the freak out of this person. And they want to make up some things with you. This could be a Leo for some of y'all. When I'm with you, I feel safe. Okay. So if you're a feminine energy uh, and you're thinking about... If you're a masculine energy and this feminine energy is thinking about you. It's like this may be a straight female that feels so safe with you that she wants to do an orgy. I don't know. Take out or resonate. You know, but somebody feels very safe with you and they got a lot of sexual fantasies when it comes to you yeah mm. whoa okay this person might like the same sex you got confusion about sexuality so also what I'm picking up is it's somebody that is the same sex of you that you make feel very safe and this person like likes you like yeah like they want to do some nasty things to you okay i have looked for you and everyone i've been with after you no one compares so okay some of y'all dealing with a cancer <laughs> i mean it could be any sign but i'm picking up like this could be a friend you ain't even know this person was kind of you know what I'm saying? And it's like your energy is so fulfilling. You know, this person can't find your energy in another friend, a, a lover, or anything of that sort. And they're turned on by you. Like, you know, um, so this is for a few of you guys. It won't be for everybody. But there's somebody that's confused about their sexuality. They could even be a musician for some of you guys. They may like music. This person came off as somebody that was well respected to you with you at one point. But I feel like they sabotaged it. This person may have left you bored or you could have just been bored with them. Like everything reminds this person of you, but you coming out in reverse. You don't even think about this person anymore and they dreaming about you. They trying to come for your connection, but a lot of you guys are single. There's not a connection that they can come for. And even if you're not single, if you have somebody, you really love your person. Nobody can come in between y'all but y'all. You see, so this person blackmailed you at some point, you know, because they felt like they were losing control. And they've been manifesting that cat or that wine for quite some time. I'm going to tell you that. 
Oh, they got some pictures of you guys or a video or something like that that they use to pleasure themselves. But some of you guys is a Capricorn or a truck driver. Somebody who failed to make an important decision when it comes to you. I'm also seeing Alter. So there's there's somebody, and this is completely a whole different subject here, but I'm picking this up. There's someone that you may have lost. This could be an ancestor, a grandparent, a whatever, a mom. Somebody that you really love, okay? Could have even been somebody that raised you. I'm getting a grandma for a lot of you guys. And your grandmother may have transitioned. Um, and it's like, you feel like you can't find that love nowhere. Like, you can't find the love that your grandmother gave you or your or somebody is somebody it don't even have to be your grandmother but you can't find that love no more like this is somebody that's well respected and you understand now why they're well respected which you respected them anyway because it's somebody that you really love but it's like you really notice the love that they show you because it ain't around it's like they don't make this kind of love no more that's what i'm picking up here yeah Mm hmm. So you guys come from a strong foundation. Whoever your mother or your father or your grandparent or somebody, whoever raised you is a strong person. Yeah. And you feel like you can't find nobody to show you that type of love no more. Building your own business. Okay. Respect. Respect. I see a lot of you guys are putting in work for yourselves. Making some, some, some ends meet. You feel me? And getting some things. Breaking some ancestral patterns around here. Your ancestors are very proud of you. If you have an altar, you need to visit your altar. Give your offerings. Definitely speak to your ancestors. I see um, somebody tried to convince their family that you was the problem. Because you were applying pressure. Could be a Virgo for some of you guys. Um, but I see that you were the best thing that ever happened to this person. And now that you're gone, <laughs> they realize it. Virgo Taurus Capricorn. Yeah. Okay. Praying on your downfall, baby. So a lot of you guys could be building your own foundation, like I said right now. Somebody's praying on your downfall with your connections, with your business, with everything, with the way that people respect you. And it's a Cancer Pisces Scorpio. This person is a cold-hearted person, and it's because they can't control you. For some of y'all, I'm hearing now, um, they want to do something like, they, they definitely want to get you pregnant. This is somebody that has been chasing you. They wanted you to chase them, but you didn't. They caused confusion due to guilt. And you seen right through it. So I see that you literally, yeah, bell ring, you seen right through it. And you trusted the process. Yeah, this person may have tried to have some type of, like, basically they're a duke shooter. <laughs> like, this person, and y'all know what that is. Put it together. If y'all don't, I don't know what to tell y'all. But this person only wants you so no one else gets you. They see you leveling up. They've been stalking. Trust and believe. They see you leveling up. Yeah. Mm. I told you. They see you leveling up. Listen to your girl. Illegally stalking. Wearing a mask. So somebody on your page. Ain't who they say they are. Somebody watching you. You guys could also have a lot of mutual friends. They may even watch you through your mutual friends page. And they think you so smart, but they hate you so much. <laughs> this person hate that you're so intelligent. It's like, ooh, Because they, they never expected you to pick up on this confusion that they tried to cause into your life. But you picked up every little detail. This person is a catfish. And at the end of the day, you're focusing on your money, baby. You're not tripping. This person is a Karen right now. They being a Karen right now. <laughs> this person is locked in the room, thinking about you, trying to find dirt on you, like thirsty energy. And they just want you so nobody else. And this is the reason why they're going to try to get you pregnant. I've been picking up this energy a lot. Somebody going to try to knock you up because they feel like 
Yeah, they feel like this is the snake, man. They feel like you're well respected. They don't want nobody else to have you. And this person is preying on your downfall. They feel like if they can't have you, nobody can have you. You could have told this person they were wasting your time. That definitely pissed them off. That pissed them off. I see you shining from within, though. You ain't mad. You're not mad about anything, baby, because you're winning. You don't have time to be mad. You're too busy being happy, okay? And this is what this person don't like. Mm -mm. They feel like you stuck up. They love sick. You doing your thing, man. Like, I already know. Because it's the same same thing, different day with this person. Just round and round, and you're not dealing with it. It could be a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. This person's jealous. They do not want you to be with anybody else. This person's been doing magic, whatever. So if you realize that none of your connections have been working out, trust me. It's because either somebody, on, well, this person, definitely, your person is doing magic. But also, it could be something, somebody that your person is connected with as well. Somebody that likes to steal time, energy, money, sex, whatever. Just a vampire. Somebody that sucks the life out of you. Somebody that probably ghosted you. But then they blackmailed you. It's so weird because they try to cause so much confusion. Like, and it's like you really real life seen through this person. You seen them for being shallow. Look, emotional manipulative. This person was not skilled. They sitting up here trying to fit a square into a circle. It ain't make sense to you. Yeah, it ain't make enough sense for you to even be confused. You knew off bat this was some BS. Like, yeah, uh-uh. No. <laughs> like, no. Find another one. I, I'm hearing some of you guys tell this person, play with your kids. Don't play with me. Yeah, because it's not a game. See, this person been doing this for a long time with other people, and it worked. But with you, you're too smart for that. You're too smart. That's why they think you a snob, because you don't just fall for the okie doke. Yeah. All right. You knew this person wasn't good for you, but it's like they felt good to you. So I see you left them behind. It ain't take you long at all. Like, and then for some of you guys, this person was dealing with some type of third party. They knew wasn't good for them. You feel me? This was just somebody who was jealous of their happiness with somebody else and emotionally manipulated them and they fell for the okie doke. So they didn't slept with somebody that wasn't even good for them. Now they looking stupid. Sorry, yeah, this person should have been putting their energy into you in this connection, but instead they was putting their energy in other people. Now they on some, for some of y'all, they on some homo, they, they homo, and I'm going to keep it 100, they DL. Yeah, this person was doing things just to try to get your attention, like... And it's like you felt like, okay, this person just a little challenge. I can work with it. Like, I'm not used to it, but I can work with it. I'm going to trust the process. Nah, it wasn't no little challenge. It was a whole full-blown mask. This ain't no challenge. This It's easy. Yeah, it's easy. Because this, this person's only intentions was to have sex with you and please your body. They had nothing to do with your mind, your soul, your spirit. They couldn't even touch you on that level. They too used to dealing with surface level people. Yeah, they never met nobody with your type of energy, your type of vibe. This person is unskilled because they ain't never had training. They've been dealing with weak energies, people that make them feel empowered. Yeah, this person's a weak-minded person. Yeah, that's why you're not having sex with them. Even though you might really care about them. You looking for somebody new, something different. Because you realize that this person ain't got nothing to offer for you. They can't give you nothing. They can't be loyal to you. You can't trust them with your heart, your emotions. They can't be honest. They wasting time. You got catfish, wolf and sheep's clothing. Like this person is a, a poor example of an existence of a human species. Like I don't even know where to start with this person. This is a vulture. You see what I'm saying? And you realize they got nothing for you. Now this person feels small because there's not anything that they can do for you. Period, point blank. They don't have what it takes. Yeah, this person feels small as they should 
because their brain small. Yeah, as they should. They should feel small. Yeah, this person is depressed. They can't even sleep at night. And that's what they get for being a coward. This person could never speak on their feelings. They couldn't balance things out. They couldn't reciprocate. No collaboration. Like, I will go in on this person, y'all. But we ain't gonna give them that much time. You feel me? We gonna go ahead and read a chakra. A Angel number 1515. Let's go ahead and read a chakra. Alright. Clear some of this energy out. Because I'm about to flame y'all person. We'll be here all day. If you get, let me get to telling it. We'll be here all day. I'm trying to tell you. Like. For real. There you go baby. You got the third eye chakra. The sixth chakra. Acknowledge spirit. I trust in a higher source. And I acknowledge my direct connection with it. In the stillness. I listen for the wisdom inside. And I am open to the spiritually, the spirituality that is within and all around me. I know that love is the creative force. I meditate and welcome mystical truths. I am open to seeking guidance and spiritual quests from a spiritual teacher, master, or guru. All right. Yeah, that's what's up. So you definitely are connecting with your spirit. You're understanding that you have to go within to get the information that you need. Because a lot of people around you is fraud. I'm going to be honest with you. They're not who they say they are. So you have to meditate on a lot of things. You have to welcome mystical truths. Even like people like myself, spiritual teachers, masters, gurus, you know, just Finding your tribe, you know, finding your authentic tribe, your your soul tribe, you see, because you got a lot of wolf energy around you. And this is something that you just cannot allow in your, your space. You got a lot going on for yourself, you know, and you can't deal with people where you got to always worry about if they wearing a mask. I don't have time for this. And I know you don't either. All right. So I love you guys. Um, this is the messages that I have for you. If it resonates, if you enjoyed this reading, be sure to like and subscribe and I'll talk to you soon. Peace.